and welcome back. It has been so long. I know, I know. Thank you, thank you. We are back in Jurassic World Evolution 2 Battle Royale. Welcome. And like I said, it has been such a long time. Uh, there has been a new update. The DLC came out for the aquatics, which unfortunately um, kind of killed the last Battle Royale season we were doing. I, I didn't do it quick enough before the DLC came out to get all of the winners to do a final battle. Uh, in fact, I wasn't even going to do a battle. Maybe if we keep on doing this, if loads of mods keep on coming out, we'll be able to get some finalists and do something with it. I want them to maybe do like an obstacle course sort of thing and uh, add like a point scoring system and stuff. It would be loads of fun, more than just a battle rail, even though these are fun. But we are back again in Jurassic World Evolution 2 with the most amount of mods I have ever seen. Right on your screen, right here, already. I mean, I'm just going to slowly zoom out. Like, look, 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 look at them all. Look at them. Look at them. <laughs> There is so many. So this is the newest battle arena. I'm I'm a bit worried actually to uh, um, click uh, play because I've used the mod to place them all. So we we don't have any hatcheries. Uh, I've also included some other mods which you know make it a little bit more aesthetic. We we always go with the green areas. I thought with this time we'll do a battle arena in the desert. It could have been snow. We've done snow before, but desert looks cool. So I am for the first time about to click spaceball and um i'm worried i'm worried guys i have put everything down there is so freaking many dinosaurs we'll quickly go over a look at some of them so we've got the vastatosaurus rex or v rex it's called from king kong you've got the mega raptor that even might be a mipe mipasaur which was one of the uh, biggest uh mega raptors that was around of course you've got the t-rex you've got i think that's a cryolophosaurus i'm not too sure what that one is you've got also some small things of course you've got these guys which are official dlcs but there is uh like a tiny little oh look at the beyonce boof look at the frog here <laughs> we got some really cool mods here I mean, of course, only the best mods. Capybara, there it is, look at it. Something that we thought we were gonna get in Jurassic World Dominion or any Jurassic film for the longest time. The Microceratus, I think it is. The big boy here, finally. It was in Jurassic World Evolution for a long time, but it just seemed to take ages for it to make its way over to Jurassic World Evolution 2, and that is the Ultimasaurus. Yes, it looks glorious, as well as, you know, some other old ones like the Ankylodocus, Indominus Rex still there. And for the first time, let's hold our breath and click play. Oh, no, hold on, before we do that, also, we've got the we've got flyers in, because now, you know, I could have got them before, we could have done the, the Avery hatchery glitch, but now seeing as I can just place anything, we could even place aquatic creatures, but they would just sort of lie there and go, I can't do anything. <laughs> so we got all the flies in. Of course, the Quetzalcoatlus is here too. Let's just click space bar. Well, there you have it. Um, they shouldn't attack each other. Oh my God, there's going to be so many. <laughs> Look at them go. There's loads of little Listro. They are making their way. What are they doing? They're, I think a lot of them will be panicking. Sauropods climbing the cliffs. We've got uh, a little patchy rhinosaurus there. Tyrandon flying around. All oh, the Tyrandons. Where's the Quetzal? That would be... Oh, there it is, of course. Uh, they're all spreading out, <laughs> getting away from each other. All of the herbivores are, that's for sure. The little Montosaurus. I say little, big, chunky Montosaurus there. The Carnotaurus. And we've got the Dinochirus doing cool little sidesteps there. Beautiful. Oh, and just having the Quetzes over this battle arena. This has to be one of the most aesthetically pleasing uh, battle royales we are ever going to have. Because we've got the hedges blocking off the fences. You've got some treetops there. You've got flyers in here. Uh, you've got multiple elevations. Again, this is just something I quickly mocked up. You've got mods to add like rocks inside of rocks and stuff. We've got a little bit of a lake here. I don't know. I try my best to make this a very nice thing to look at. I didn't want to overcomplicate it. I think there's still a couple of things that I'm, I could change to make it look better. I'm not a pro when it comes at making environments. I'll, I'll be the first to admit that. I don't know what the little Kentrosaur is doing there. <laughs> Cooling down in the heat probably is what it's doing. We got Draco Rex there. Oh God, what are you? What even are you? <laughs> You're like a herbivore for you. You are those teeth, you definitely aren't. Hold on. Avrosaurus. 
Interesting, never heard of that thing. Of course, you've got the fairy, Spino here looking glorious, Taurosaur. There it is, the Mipe Macrothorax. So this actually is the Mipe, so I don't know what the other thing was. Uh, one of the bit, the newest additions to Path of Titan modding at the time of recording as well. We've also got this thing, the Gigantoraptor, which is basically like a giant bird from the Miocene? I don't know. Like, walk with beasts, it looks like, but it's so cool. I love this. Mods, man, they make every game gorgeous. Here we go. We've got, uh, oh, you're know, not the thing. The, what's this called? The Bear Necessity Sutures. <laughs> oh, God, no, that's, that's a fence. We don't want to click that. I'm trying to click on this guy. So, I think it's probably like a Dimetrodon animation set, but uh, yeah, it's also the tiniest, the tiniest of little hadrosaurs ever! This thing, the Ajnabaya, I think. Oh, it's gorgeous, look at it, it's like a baby! <laughs> it's adorable! Okay, what else we got? We got the Albert eyebrows there. Oh, look! Were the Tropogonathus sitting on a rock there? Lovely! Look, it's, it's, it's very rewarding when you get to see them interact with the environment that you've made. That it is the Vestatosaurus Rex. You've got the Australola Titan. That's the thing. Here it is, Adaphosaur. I was right, I think. Oh, the Adaphosaur looks gorgeous there if the camera's not uh, being constantly murdered by a sauropod. It's like, can't go there. The cameraman's having a problem phasing through the sauropod. But it looks so good. Look at its eyes. <laughs> Does it know what's going on or can it see the universe all at the same time? I don't know. There's a lot there's a lot to unpack in that head, that's for sure. We've got the mammoth coming back as well. Oh look at the Pteranodon! Adorable! And then the baby, we've got Critonosaurus, Kendrosaur here, Carnotaurus. I'm not exactly too sure how many dinosaurs there are here, but there are a Rotten, and it's going to be very interesting because some of the Tyrannodons have animations with the smaller dinosaurs. There is, of course, a Compi running around here somewhere as well. I'm not too sure where that guy is. Never mind, I heard it. Although, no, it's a Troodon. We've got a Troodon and an Ornithalestes. Interesting. If I can kind of see it. There it is, Ornithalestes. Looking very different from your walking with dinosaurs counterpart, that's for sure. Celia Physis, Hararasaur. Oh, it's. Oh, never mind. This thing apparently is a Utah Raptor. Uh, very interesting. Okay, well, what we got over here? We got the Phosphorachus. We've got a prehistoric, I mean, they're all prehistoric, let's be honest, a uh, Terrabird from a completely different uh, timeline. Uh, but it's here. Walk with beasts, meet walking with dinosaurs. Speaking of walking with beasts, we've got the Megatherium, the giant ground sloth over here too. As well as a concavenator, mixing with an Australoraptor, I think it is. Australovenator, I think. Something like that. Anyway, there's a lot of dinosaurs with weird names. And they seem to have kind of spread out to all corners. And I'm glad this seems to be big enough for them to do that. You've got the Bonitosaurus struggling to get up the hill there. And this thing is the Titanolophosaurus. Is that a real thing? God knows. Well, it, it's in the game. It's a mod and it's here to stay. You strep... What's it? You streptospondylus. You streptospondylus. There you go. Lovely red skin there. Have we got some of the, the flyers? Uh, oh, no. The Okay. The quetzal is... It's left. It's already left. I thought it might not, but no. It has left the building. <laughs> Maybe it'll pick up some humans. I don't know. We have... Yeah, look. Oh, they kind of do use it. Are they up here even? Again, some beautiful mods. There is so countless. An army of people have created all of these, it feels like. And they have just made this game feel so much more alive than it ever could without mods. RIP console players is all I gotta say. I'm so sorry. I wish I wish there was something I could do. I really do. Oh, this thing, the, what's it called? The Ogrunlac. This thing keeps on phasing in and out of existence. I don't know why. I think my camera gets a certain like angle on it and it goes nope doesn't exist maybe that will help i don't know in that battle so without further ado you've seen the contestants can you guess who is going to win well guess no longer because we're about to turn on combat baby and we are off there combat is turned on herbivores can do it as well um there is no uh, starving there is no dehydration going on here oh look at the little capra switches look at him go Oh, oh, is he? Is, oh, sorry, I got stuck on a cactus there. Look, he's so adorable. 
Right, yep, things will now start to hunt other things. I'm assuming a lot of the herbivores are probably going to start dying. Oh, God. Ye no? Oh, it looked like you were kind of doing something there. Trand on there, swooping down. woohoo Have we got any deaths? A fight has started between... Oh, Phosphorac... There's a lot of fights, let's be honest. There's already something dead. I want to see these two. Concavenator and a Phosphoracus. The Terrorbird fight. Oh, he has the high ground. Anakin. Can, will he win this one? I don't know. Let's see. Let's see it play out. Oh, never mind. No, high ground was only there so it could get away quicker. <laughs> uh, Ramsey Cole's not happy with that. He's also not on speaking terms with me either. He just, he's just ringing me and giving me the silent treatment, apparently. Oh, we've got Carnotaurus there with a victory. Fantastic. Like to see it. Never seen Toast win any battle royales. Will this be the first one? I don't know. Quetz are uh, just sitting there looking glorious. I don't think Quetz could be killed by anything. So that maybe, you know, if they can't be hunted or killed by anything, we don't count that as a victory. Oh! <laughs> we've got a possessed Indoraptor taking on... I has no idea what that thing is, but it doesn't even matter what it is, because it is being killed by Indoraptor. There you go. A little bit of uh, puppetry going on there. Maybe some psychic uh, powers from the Indoraptor. Latent psychic abilities that we can only dream of. Okay. Phosphoracus got away, unharmed. Little Listro still alive. Proceratosaurus. We've got the... Oh my god, Uteranus. That's the one. There's the Mipe! Hello, Mr. Mipe, with your little snoot. Do you have a droop snoot? No, I don't know. Well, let's see what else is going on. We have Triceratops against a Scorpius Rex. Oh, I love the little Carithosaur things here. I see a Minmi there. We've got that giant uh, Shastasaur, I think that is. Oh, we got the Venatoraptor thing that's over there. Yeah, that thing. That's also from King Kong. Are these... Oh, Quetz is coming down for something. I don't know what... Nope, just gonna go for a sit. Okay, they're not fighting each other. I hear a Dilophosaur, though. Oh, Dilophosaur's taking some hits from something. I don't know what, though. It is alive. That's the important thing. Oh, Scorpius Rex comes running around. Oh, is it gonna try and take on the Apatosaur? Oh, T-Rex is still alive. Good thing. Good thing to know. Oh, <laughs> that looks glorious. King Kong. Peter Jackson would be proud of you. you oh, no, there we go. Little Bulldog's going for the, the bites of the Apatosaur while it tries to... Uh, get up the cliff. That's not very nice of it, let's be honest. Could have waited at least till it got to the top. I love the slender look of the- Oh god, just destroy the microphone! The slender look of the face there on the, uh, Vistato thing. Oh, he's- he's asleep. Hard to tell. But, uh, oh! Have we got these two facing each other? Yes, we do! You're very blurry. What's happened with your textures? Okay, that was definitely a royalty-free dragon kind of sound. Oh, 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 they were just roaring. Okay, never mind. They must have had a fight with something else recently. Oh, no! This thing's dead. Don't know what it was. Are you dead? Casmosaur? No, Casmosaur's sleeping. Never mind. Oh, we got... Oh, my God. We got three flies on this single run. <laughs> they love it. Scorpius is living up to its name. It always does this. So did... In oh, we've got another fight over there. Oh, God. Oh, I like how he's just watching him like... What are you doing? <laughs> no! Made me die! You evil fiend! How dare you! Uh, you tell him, little crocodile. Oh, and then get moving. <laughs> get to moving. Oh, God. Are these guys broken? Oh! No, they popped. Never mind. It's fine. It's fine. Oh, Ultima Sword. Chomping on, I think it's this uh, sauropod. Yeah. Kind of going for the tail there. Oh, yep. There it goes. There it goes. And it's a looking... Yes. Oh, no! Never mind. It killed it! Glorious! Oh, Scorpius against a Stegosaur. Something that can actually fight back. I don't know if that's really a good idea for it. No! Oh my god, Interruptor tearing apart the Utah Raptor there. We've got the Nigersaurs also dead. That's a bugger, but let's be honest, it was never going to survive that long. Oh, Myasaur. Holding on. No, Megatherium's dead. The Raptor! OG Raptor's also dead. Oh, Stegoceratops there. Taking a well-earned nap. That's the best thing. Play dead. Nothing will attack you. Apparently, them's the rules. Oh, God. What are you doing? 
Oh, Gigantoraptor's still surviving. Love that blue babe. Looks glorious, aren't you? Cryolophosaurus and Proceratosaurus. There can only be one crest. And it's the Cryolophosaurus crest. KO'd. Oh, we got a Giganotosaurus against... What are you? You are a Gajirasaurus. Ooh, very interesting. Ceratosaur died to Gajira. Oh, oh my god. So it's probably not going to fight this guy. They're just doing a roar off if it's just killed something. Yeah. Not surprised. Acrocanthosaurus still in it. Sukamimus still in it. I haven't seen a Baryonyx in a while. Oh no! I just saw that. No, Malos definitely ripped apart by an Indoraptor. Oh, a Trosseraptor ghost is still in it. Raptor isn't, but can a Trosseraptor win? I don't know. Really want to see. Oh, what's this? Carcal! Taking on the Eupondus Pondodlondulus. That's the one. <laughs> That's the scientific name. Yes. We're going to roll with it. Ah, they run away. They decided to call off. Contour is still alive. Still kicking. Oh, you're a lovely looking thing. Carita Saw is still alive as well. As the tiny little chunky. <laughs> Look at this thing. It's glorious. Oh, I love it. I love that. You know, this has been going on for, what, 20 minutes? And I'm still seeing new things. New dinosaurs that I didn't see before. Um, uh oh, Ultimosaurus killed the Styracosaur because it is a modern creature uh, and it hasn't been updated, I don't think. It doesn't have the correct, like, killing animations. Uh, no, Oradosaur killed, I think, by Indominus Rex. Oh, we got that thing taking on that thing. <laughs> Come on, little flyers. You're barely participating in this. I want to see some kills. Kill the Indominus Rex, go for his eyeballs. Take no prisoners. Oh, look, even the Triceratops is getting involved. It might have lost, but at least it tried. Allosaur takes the cake. <laughs> oh, Indominus Rex charging for something. Oh, it's going to go for the herbivore. No. Then you're killed. Oh, touch it. Oh, the epitome of amazing edgelord design. Love it. Oh no, Spinosaur died! Hold on, hold on. Who killed Spino? And the Mammoth. Ultima Raptor and Ultima Raptor. Whoa, we killed both of them. Cryolophosaur against Ultimasaur. Seems like a fair fight. Let's see how this one goes. I'm assuming it's just gonna drop down and die. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> That's telekinesis, Carl! <laughs> killed it. Okay. Oh no! Pentaceratops killed by this thing. I don't know what you are again. Bye! Hope you enjoyed your visit! Go back again anytime! You can see dinosaurs die all the time. There seems to be peaceful up here. The Shasta's like, mm, yes, I like this. Grab my cup of tea, please. Tea break! Grab your cups of tea! <laughs> <laughs> there is Inosaurus still kicking, Stegosaurus is still kicking, and most importantly, Indoraptor is still kicking. Uh, is that Celiophysis? Not too sure what that one is. And more importantly, the Capybara is still alive. Get in. The biggest hit is still been knocking about. I haven't seen... The only one that died, I think, has been Spino. I cannot see the uh, the T-Rex. I think that Ultimasaur is taking on the Ambelosaur. Yep, this guy is still alive. The King Kong T-Rex. Still kicking. Albertosaur taking on the other modded creature. This thing gets the bite off first. I think... I think that's Albertosaur. Oh no, it's the Changosaurus. That's right, that's what you want. It's Pinocchio. Oh, stands its ground, gets another bite off. This, I mean, the, you're, you're facing the devil itself. It looks very much like the devil. Or, oh, you know, kind of like a Carnotaurus mixed with a, a Giganotosaurus. I feel like, is there going to be another hit from Pinocchio? Okay, and then they're going to roar at each other, and I'm assuming Pinocchio's not going to win. Yes, okay, okay. Fair fight, actually. Where are you going? Come back, you stupid pterosaur. Turn around. What are you doing? <laughs> There's nothing out here for you. Whoa, that looks cool. Are you like a Gigalophosaurus? I think you should be. The Mipe? Still around? Don't know if it's got any kills. So hot right now. Creta feasting on a dead Apatosaur. Lovely, lovely. Oh my god! Freaking Struthiomimus or Archeon of the Mimus? I think you are, yeah. Archie. Uh, survived longer than a blooming Spinosaur. Has to tell you something. Stegosaur, yes. A fan favorite. 
still kicking. I have no idea what the stats are for these guys. I think they're completely random. Also got another fight over there, the Mipe. Oh, Mipe taking on an Aloe. Ooh. How's this one gonna go? I'm quite interested. A modded creature versus what, what, what was once a favorite. And they just decided to do one bite and call it off. Fair enough. Fair enough. Maybe it's too early for them. What are you? You are so cool. You're like a tiny little T-Rex thing. T-Rex must be dead. I don't know where it is, but it's definitely dead. Oh, Baryonyx! Never seen you before. So maybe there's hope for the T-Rex. Gigantoraptor again on Peace Rock. Up here with Shastasaurus, Ankylodocus, and the Mementosaur Thera. Oh, oh, never mind. We've got a Concavenator just running through, causing a ruckus. A Laura Titan. Well, yep. I, you know what I haven't seen in a while? Scorpius Rex. That's one that used to kill things all the time. And Montasaur dead. Eupocephalus coming in now. Eutoranus killed. Come on, Eupo. You got this. You can easily kill Ultimosaur. Look at it. It's not like it has horns, a tail, armor, teeth. Okay, it's dead. <laughs> not a single fight in it. My odds are probably in the Ultimosaur's favor at this moment. Oh, never mind. Dinokairus. Dead. It's furs go mental at the moment. Wait, are you Rexy? No, you're Tarbo. You're Tarbo from Prehistoric Planet. That's what you are. Oh, the four-legged or oh, the quadrupedal carnival thing's dead. Okay. <laughs> just, yeah, you might roll, but I'm just gonna, like, jump and attack you. <laughs> and then the Rex is just like, yeah, you're the high ground. So? <laughs> oh! Oh, there it goes! There it goes! <laughs> Ah, an alternate universe where Anakin, it didn't matter if uh, Obi had the high ground. Kill, there you go. It's all about the spirit and tenacity, really, there. Oh, looks like Alasaur lost that one. Very interesting. And the Gigas are facing up against this guy that was facing up against the Pinocchio, the Changesaurus. But uh, it's decided to go for a bigger prey and is actually winning. Very interesting. Oh, my God, it's still alive. The baby Hadrosaur lives. Squeaky like a little ducky. And it's got Indoraptor right next to it. <laughs> oh, God. Just whatever you do, don't turn around. Whatever you do, don't do that. Because this thing senses fear. All right? Don't do it. Don't. Oh, my God. It's going to fight it. Come on. Come on. You've got the high ground. I believe in you. Fight the Indoraptor. <laughs> no way. Why is it fighting it? <laughs> Come on. No! Oh, that's so sad. But if you close your emotional balance, emotional balance, emotional You know what? It tried. It tried its best. Oh, dear. Oh, God. Kamarasaur just getting wounds just by walking near Ultimasaur. It just has to walk around it. It just stabs it with its uh, carapace on the back. Gorgeous. Aquanodon also still kicking. Another herbivore that can fight back. Interesting. Oh, there's the T-Rex. There. Okay, what, what killed it? I'm quite curious. What killed Mr. T-Rex? An unknown. Okay. okay. Oh, Shastasaur killed the Thera. Oh, never mind. Peace Rock wasn't so peaceful after all. And we go- Oh, no. Yeah, you hate to see it, but... Nodasaur against the Chung King Osaurus, I think that is. And Scorpius Rex is alive, and it just took down the Giga. Wow, I haven't seen you in ages. But Oh, God, you've just been... Oh, Critonosaur. Uh, Megalania. Okay. Killed by the Barry. Uh, Draco Rex hunting down by Scorpius Rex as well. Okay. Oh, Vestatosaur taking on the devil thing. This is... It doesn't seem to want to, like, have a single fight with one. It wants to have a fight with everything. It loves them all equally. Or at least it starts and then doesn't finish. Regulaceratops, I think it's called, against Indoraptor. It can only end one way. And that's in the Regulaceratops winning, of course, by not even engaging. Beautiful, beautiful. Scared him. Scared him off completely. <laughs> Oh, and the Ultimasaur just slowly killing whatever that is. I think it's Mementosaur, that one. Oh, no! Dilophosaur killed by Australovenator! Oh, it made it so far. And a poisoned Ankylodocus. I don't know by what. That's interesting. Okay. Car, car taking on this thing. Oh, getting hurt by it! 
And the Ultima Saw. I think it was hunting down. So oh, the Ankylodocus. That'll be it. Yep, there it goes. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like it's doing fine at the moment, but it's about to flop any second. Oh, no. Oh, there you go. A little bit of a walk. Fair enough. Oh, my God. Stegosaur having a, a little uh, sand bath there. Loving. Loving life. It knows it's already won. Oh, it won it on against Tarbo. Very interesting. I think this could be... Oh, God. Oh, God. What's camera doing? I don't know what's camera doing. Okay, there we go. I think this could be the end of a Guanadon, though. Oh, there you go. Never mind. I did a small thing and ran away. Mipe has just killed the Changesaur, I think. Yeah, it has. And already facing up against this guy. Can't catch a break. This is it. The moment we've all been waiting for. Kendrasaur versus Indominus Rex. And yes, it's, it's over as quickly as it begun. Killed next to its best friend, I think. The, the Sticky Moloch. Ah! Oh! Uh, just one hit. One hit. Chasmosaur. Didn't even stand a chance against Scorpius. So far, we've still got the, the four big ones. We've got Scorpius Rex, Indoraptor, Indominus Rex, and the Ultimasaur. These things, they're, they're just going to go around killing as many of these dinosaurs as possible. That is Chunkingosaurus now out of the fight. Again, uh, Indoraptor, these things, they just kill everything. For some reason, they're, they're way more aggressive. They didn't qualify, I assume so. Uh, what even are you? You're a Kaliosaur. Okay, interesting. Never heard of that. Oh, a Shastasaur against the Stegoceratops. And the Stegoceratops killed it. Wow, wow. That was it. Just, it, it, it. They all seemed peaceful at one point. And then they just killed each other. Oh, my God. Really? Yeah, it wasn't going to last too long, was it? <laughs> Instantly killed. I have no idea what my camera is doing. You know, if anything, you looked pretty in the distance. Oh, my against Vastatosaurus Rex. Two favorites. But yeah, I mean, the size is Vastatosaurus. It's definitely going to win that. I don't know what the Scorpius Rex is lining up for. Oh my god, it's like a tiny... Oh, is that the Chunkingosaurus? Well, one hit, and it also died. Okay, so you won that one, and you didn't stand a chance against the Scorpius Pufferfish. Miragaya against Tarbo. Tarbo fresh off its victory from, uh, Iguanodon, but yeah, I think that's, that's definitely a dead. What are you? Jesus, you must be from King Kong as well. You're like a modified, uh, Sinoceratops. Oh, Indominus Rex against a freaking Ravosaurus. And Indominus Rex is going to win that one. Okay, don't you see that? Although it does get a fight, was it? 85% against 68%, so it's close. They'll both hit each other again, and that'll be the end of it. Oh, Ultimasaur taking on the Iguanodon. No! It, ha it hasn't had enough time to heal, and down it goes. Bless it there. Well, at least it tried. Kaka, you're, uh, you're not looking too hot there, mate. That's gonna take like a million mummy kisses to heal. Oh! Scorpius taking on the uh, Peter Jackson Triceratops thing. And one hit. And it actually survives. But remember, Scorpius Rex is one of those carnivores that actually has venom. So even if it doesn't win, uh, it needs to get a hit off. Yeah, I think. There we go. Or is it going to die? I don't know. I don't know. I think it might die. Is it going to die? <laughs> Just kind of looked at it. Oh, another one. Another hit. Are you taking damage? What's going on with that little head of yours? I don't even know. I don't even know. I don't even, did, it, did it do damage to it? Well, let's find out. Right, it's 90% and Scrub's on 80%. That's not very good. Not very good. This thing's still kicking. Wow. It's had fights with every... I, you know what? Maybe it just doesn't even have fights. They just circle around things and then it runs away. Maybe that's its strategy. It's like, I'm having a fight with this thing, so... Nothing else can attack me, and then... Oh, no! A hit does come in! Interesting. Just wait until it had not the high ground. Okay. Gigantoraptor here as well. Love this thing. Looks glorious. Allosaur still kicking. Oh, oh, okay. We got a dead... Whatever that was. Dead Mizutoceratops. He's behind you! <laughs> Look at those two. Are they glorious? A birdie... And, well, an abomination. You be the judge of which one's which. <laughs> what are they just doing? They're just doing their animation. Oh, what a bit itchy neck. Oh, yes. 
Oh, we don't want to fight each other. No, no, no. Wow, this this has got barren. So many things have died. The last of the sauropods, the Camarasaurus there. Oh, Vastatosaurus taking on the uh, Scorpius Rex. Very interesting. Let's see. Who will win? Go on then. Scorpius got one hit off. You've got to at least hit him once. Oh, 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 or run away. Just take that venom and, and lose health slowly. It's a very clever tactic. Yeah, I didn't even get hit once. Wait, where's the quits? Oh my god, there's the quits. <laughs> it's all the way out here. What are you doing? All right, Baron. Oh, Indominus Rex taking on this thing. Oh, killed it now. Oh, when the animations work. They look so freaking good. The weight of it just slamming it down. It's such a shame that a lot of the time you don't see it. Oh, I'm kind of sorry against the Gigas. No! Surely not! Ooh, I like the clicks that it made. They're like. Skit, skit, scrap! Oh. Oh! Oh! Gojira, so. What are you doing? Don't, don't take on Indoraptor. It's not worth it, dear. You're gonna die! Or- Oh my god, never mind! Indoraptor of such a promising component- A component? Opponent! Killed by Goji! I think you are Goji, aren't you? Hold on. Yes, I was right. Okay, you are Goji. Stegosaur's still in it, guys. Can't rest until Stegosaur's out of it. What we got here? Ultimasaur against the Mike? Oh, because they're modern creatures, they can attack each other. <gasps> That's brilliant. Maybe their animation will work. Ultima saw getting the high ground there. That was tactical. But um, is, is he going to, uh, you know, do anything with it? No, no, just one hit. That's all he needs. Whittle it down a little bit. Scorpius Rex trying to take on this thing. You know, at this point, he's just stalking. I like, just leave him be. <laughs> That's right. Scare him away. Could you be the winner, Goji? You know, look, you got such an underbite, dude. Look at that. Look at that. <laughs> oh, never mind. It did. It didn't face it. It, I, it has been hit, I think. Oh, 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 okay, okay. Health 90%, 81% now. We've got a Pyraptor. Oh, a mini league Pyraptor against. What even? What the hell are you? <laughs> it won, though. A Paralotherizinosaurus. Like a really short version of Fairy. Are you like a tiny subspecies? It's one, two. Wow, amazing. Well done. What are you? Oh, you're the bat thing. Like you're still alive. Oh! Ultimasaur against the Scorpius. Ultimasaur gets the first hit off. It doesn't want to be hit by the Scorpius because then it will get poisoned. Just one bite and then end it, I think, is the best situation here. Yeah, there you go. It just couldn't muster up the courage to get that poison on. I'm genuinely curious. Can I spot the queds? Yeah, there it is. <laughs> All the way in the desert. What are you doing up here, buddy? Why are you so far away? You just keep wanting to be here. I don't know. You can't get on that rock, mate. Oh, Indoraptor and Vistat. Oh, another victory for a modern creature. Vistatosaurus Rex killing. The Indominus Rex there. How many kills did you have? You had 10 victories and then just instant death. I think it was poisoned. How many victories did Indoraptor have? Seven. And then what we got here, your Scorpius against the Regili. Oh, jeez. Oh, no, killed instantly. No, it was on 83%. I thought it would at least get like a hit off. But no, death. How many kills do you have, dude? Eight. Wow, Indominus Rex had the most amount of kills that I've seen so far. What about the Ultimasaur? Ultimasaur, surely you've killed- Oh, okay, you you're rivaling the Indominus Rex. With and picking fights with stuff like Nodosaurus, I can see how you're getting the most amount of kills. This is not fair. You could flick it and it would die. There you go, see, just fell over and died. <laughs> so for the herbivores, we still have Ankylosaur and we still have Stegosaur. Oh, finally getting in on the action. I don't think I've ever seen this thing fight untested. Has it got any kills? It has four victories and three kills even. I need. Okay, just never seen it. Oh, there you go. 
Yep, that's the Therizinosaurus animation. And is it going to get one more? Oh, yep, there it is. Takes its health down to 57. That, that's a solid victory. 57 against 54. I, okay, maybe it wasn't. No, 57 seemed like a good number to have. Oh, that thing has poison. The Titanolophosaurus has poison. Oh. Right, I was wondering how things are still getting poison because I don't think the Scorpius Rex is around anymore. Vestato, how many, how many kills? One kill. One kill. And oh! There was Stegosaur taking on Scorpius Rex. No, this could be the end for, for plates for days. Oh, it takes it to 83%. Doesn't look too banged up. Oh, a charge. Trades off 66%, but the Venom's going to slowly do... Oh, my God. <laughs> Whoa, what is... That's a new yoga pose, that one. Jesus. 40% with five minutes of poison on it. Ultimasaur taking on the Vastatosaurus Rex. Is it going to get revenge for the Indominus Rex? And it does. Kills it, crumpled into a pile of flesh and bone on the floor. Ultimasaur's attacks and kills now on 12. Hasn't lost a single fight. I tell you what, the poison's doing work. The Gigantoraptor is now on like 24% because of the poison. Stego is also on 20% because of the poison. Five minutes is a lot of passive damage to deal. Oh my god, the frog's still alive! <laughs> oh, these guys are deciding to call it off. That's good, that's good. But friggin' Beelzebub, how are you still- Look at it, guys! <laughs> This is, this is exactly what we needed. Some comic relief at the end of this. Oh, Ultimasaur now taking on the Allosaur. Again, first ever Battle Royale Royal we've ever had. I think Allo won. And uh, killed. Truly unstoppable, this thing. 7%. Oh, 5%. 4%. 3%. I don't think it's going to make it. I don't think it's going to make it. It's going to die. Oh, that's a shame. I think the Stego... Yep, Stego's gone too. Killed by the Venom. Damn. Damn, I think both of those... Well, no, Stegosaur wasn't going to win. But Gigantoraptor got the first hit of... So, ah. Oh, they about like 50... 50 odd percent or so. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, the real winner. <laughs> What's it doing? What's it doing? What's it? The real winner is this guy. I don't get what you say. That's the real winner. Some amazing dinosaurs have died here that have had way more kills and way more deserving of a place in the final, as opposed to one kill freaking Acrocatosaurus. Oh! A poison! This could be interesting. Okay, Ultima Sword gets the first hit off. Okay, okay. Oh, and it kills it! This thing didn't have a chance! The Gigalophosaurus, whatever it's called, did not get a chance to inflict its venom on the Ultimasaur. Damn, okay! Yep, what does that take its kill count to? Like, 14. It should be... It feels like that should be more. Okay, luckily, my has apparently got a better resistance to the venom than the other dinosaurs. Uh, although, saying that... The, uh, oh god, this isn't looking good. Oh, yep, yep, there we go. Yep, yep. As soon as the Venom wore off, the Scorpius Rex came over and was like, nah, not having that and killed it. It's such a shame, because the Scorpius Rex has all this time to recover from the damage, yet its opponent that's been Venomed, they get Venomed, um, doesn't, and then it just dies. Oh, well, we've got one guy enjoying the show. Not even facing it, actually. Could this be the end of Scorpius Rex? And it bloody well was! Barely had time to, to catch that. And lovely way to die. Oh, too much. Ha! Ha! Agricathosaurus, what are you doing? You've only had one victory. You about to die. You gonna flop? I feel like it's gonna flop. Go on. Go on. Look at you smooth. Never mind. One bite was all it needed. <laughs> it's gone. Uh, just get it over with. Just kill it. There we go. Oh, oh, oh my god. Whoa. I broke it in half there with your psychic abilities. Oh, they threatened it for a while. Uh, but will they attack each other? 
Is it going to die? Oh, okay. That was the animation for them to sort of clash and then spin around. So that's an even fight. Okay. Next one. Oh, a hit. Right. Okay. That's not looking good for the Stegoceratops. But at least it's putting up more of a fight than the Scorpius Rex did. He's already like, no, no. No, no. No, no. You're going to lose. Oh, some scars appearing. <laughs> I love how glitchy these fights can get, man. Oh, I won! No way! Stegoceratops, you did it! Well done! Okay, they've called the fight back on just as Stegoceratops gets back up to 100%. And Goji is on like 70? I think it's on 80% health. So this will be interesting to see how this one goes. Because he won last time. With it. Oh, there we go. The slide and then the ping. There we go. The lag. Can't hit what you can't see. And then... Ooh, is it going to lag again? Oh, and then it hit again. Oh, even more scores for the Goji. And are we going to have a finisher? What are we going to do? Oh, my God. Oh, oh, we did have a finisher. Goji down. Stego Ceratops could be in with a chance here. It has one final thing really to take on. And that is the Ultima Soul. Here it is. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, sorry, my bad. Here we go. The final fight. Oh, two horned creatures. And actually, this Stegosaurus got the first hit in. No way. Both of them hybrids, separated by like 20 years. And it looks like the Ultimate Saw. Oh, it took a hit so bad that it ran away. <laughs> 100% still for the Stegoceratops. With that one hit, 45%. That's like death. Now, in Jurassic World Evolution, if they were going to win a fight, the first bite would do 45% and the second bite would kill. So, I did not expect the Ultima Saw. What are you doing? 120 attack, 70 defense. Oh, 134 attack. 120 defense. Yeah, that's like 50 more defense than you have. So stats, they do affect the battle, but it's not always like, oh, well, it's got better stats, it'll win because it might have less health. It might have been poisoned, you never know. And in this situation, because they've had so much time to be apart, to heal, it really depends if the ultimate sword wants to fight back straight away as it's on 80% right now, the Stegoceratops is on 100. So if they choose to fight, it could be the end of Ultima Saw. It needs to wait till it gets to 100%. The Ultima Saw does not want to have a battle so badly with the Stegoceratops that it's willing to take some damage from the Acrocanthosaurus. I don't know. I don't know who's going to win this, actually, after that loss. Because combat, I think, also has something to do with it. You know, if, it lo if a dinosaur loses quite a bit. Okay, okay, it won, but at what cost? 33%. 74%. What is... You are infamy level 5. And what is Acro? Infamy level 3. Stegoceratops is infamy level 1, even. Oh, this is the end of Acro. The end of Acro right here. Yep, down it goes. To be expected, I think he was only on 80% health. And of course, Ultima Saur was on 100. And now, the final battle begins between the Horned Carnival and the Horned Herbivore. A genetically modified creature, a fan favorite since the Chaos Effect the dinosaur thing launched for the Lost World, and then we kind of were supposed to get this figure, but then it never released. And now, well, we're here. Okay, I got bored, right? <laughs> oh, that's it. They've spotted each other. They've spotted each other. He's slowly walking over. Stegosaurus is like, ah, I didn't see anything. I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, it's lining itself up. Look at that. He was like, no, no, no. If you're going to fight me, I'm going to have the high ground. Oh, oh, it's all about big brain here. And the clash. Oh, there it is. Straight away the hit. And could this be the end, Voldemort? Oh, do you think it'll run away again after all of that? It could come to an end right here. Is it? Oh, okay. Oh, God, straight away. <laughs> Enough. Oh, my God. <laughs> Didn't even get a hit off. It was that bad. Yeah, again, 45% just couldn't do it. Oh, he just sort of came along and was like, I would have a little sit too. <laughs> Both get up around about the same time. 
Will they engage straight away on 80%? Yes, they do. Will this be the end for Ultima Soul? It could be if Stegoceratops can just land the final blow. Look at that. You're watching your death. I don't know why you're doing this. I mean, I know why. For the views, for the entertainment, the... Oh, not, not that one. Not that one. This one for the views. Here we go. Go on then. Just one final hit. Can he do it? Can he even... Oh. Oh my god, there it goes. The hit. Down Ultimusaur goes. And we have our victor. Never before has Stegoceratops won one. But the combination of Stegoceratops, oh, sorry, Stegosaur and Triceratops in this time has been victorious. Well done, dude, well done! And there you have it. I mean, we have loads of other things. If we have a look on the map, there's there's like a bunch of tiny things. The Overraptor, uh, all the flyers and didn't do anything. Quetzal buggered off over there, so we didn't want to hunt anything. Lystrosaur, anything was tiny, kind of survived. If there was another winning, you could say it's that tiny, uh, Therizinosaurus. This thing actually, I think, did get some kills. There's two kills. <laughs> yeah, this weird looking turkey thing also won. But really, it was Stegoceratops. Ultimasaur, in the end, had one loss, 16 kills, and 17 victories. And Stegoceratops had four kills and five victories so if you have enjoyed this video leave a like if you want to see more battle royals and until next time i'll see you guys later oh bye bye